today we're going to be doing Elliot Choi. Um, the reason why is because someone commented on my last video asking about Elliot Choi. And I decided, yeah, why not? Let's do him. I actually like his YouTube videos. I'm already familiar with him. Yeah, if this is the type of YouTube videos you like, make sure to subscribe because this is exactly what this channel is about. We go over YouTubers channels using in-camera evidence on um, exactly what camera they're using. So yeah, that's pretty much it. That's the gist of this channel. And uh, yeah, if this channel helps you, make sure to like and uh, yeah, supports me a lot and uh, keeps me motivated and keeps me going. And comment down below which YouTuber you guys want us to cover next. So, yeah, let's get on to it. Let's go to the research. One, two, three, fuck. All right, we're back at the airport. I was just in LA last night. Yep, it is the Sony A7S 3 simply because on the top of the dial, so the A7 IV doesn't have a lock on the top of the dial. So as you can see here, on top of the dial, it's like flat. It's just it's just flat. Um, with this one, it has like a button on top. You see how it has a button? This is the Sony A7S 3 and this is the Sony A7 IV. So meaning, if you want to rotate the dial, you have to press the button to unlock it. So that's how you know this is the Sony A7S 3 So all my research, watching all the past videos, what's kind of useless, I could, could have just watched this. And from how the, the lens protrudes out of the camera or out of the lens, that is the Sony Zeiss 16 to 35 F4. And um, I'm actually surprised that he's using this lens. He's probably using it because it's lighter and it has OSS, uh, optical image stabilization or optical and um, yeah, that's probably why he uses it. I'm surprised he's not using the G Master 1635 f2.8 simply because it lets more light in, but he doesn't. So he uses that with the Rode VideoMic Pro Plus. I'm going to show you guys right here, this uh, microphone over here. So um, yeah, that's pretty much his camera gear. Very simple, actually. It's actually not too crazy. And um, well, not too crazy. The camera body itself costs a lot. Why? <laughs> <laughs> oh, so no, he doesn't edit on Final Cut Pro. As you can see from this shot over here, he edits on Adobe Premiere, probably because that's what they typically learn in a film school. I don't know if you went to a film, film school or not. You guys can um, confirm with me in the description of the video in the comment section. Um, but yeah, he doesn't film in Final Cut. So that's what's different from him and other youtubers so um yeah that's adobe premiere so adobe premiere costs a lot more actually because there is a monthly subscription fee for that but uh i believe for students you can get a discount so yeah that's pretty much his gear you do it what's kelly call you steady shot steady shot i need the steady shot magic touch <laughs> Ooh. oh there it is so, that's not too heavy looking it's pretty good actually that's pretty this good. This fits your hand, nice. Whoa. Whoa. Ready? Yeah. This is all you. Take it away. So yeah, if you want to know what um, Amory uses, she you, she explains it all in this video. So you guys can just actually just watch this video. That's pretty much it. Um, that's what camera Amory Chase and Elliot Choi uses. And as far as for editing, we know Elliot Choi uses Adobe Premiere. And for Amory Chase, I couldn't really find the exact way she edits. Um, she does hire, like she said in that video, she hires um, uh, Kelly's video videographer named Colt to edit her videos. So chances are she used Adobe Premiere as well, just so they can transfer the files e easier. Um, and yeah, that's pretty much it. If you guys enjoy this channel or if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to let me know in the comment section below. And also comment down below which YouTuber you guys want me to cover next. And yeah, that's pretty much it. This channel is exactly just about what's their camera and what camera youtubers are using so yeah make sure to comment down below make sure to let me know what you guys think about this youtube video and um yeah let's uh let's do some more other let's do some other youtubers so that's pretty much it thanks for watching peace man this video was long one hour. hello
just sit on